Hi there, welcome to TMC. Today I'll be looking at this 2019 Nissan Navara finished in grey. I'll be doing a little walk around the vehicle today showing you all the key features, details and cosmetics. And I'll be sure to point out anything over and above that of general wear and tear. First of all, we're starting out with the bonnet of the vehicle. As I scan across, you might see a few signs of general wear and tear, a few small stone chips or uh, marks in the paint, but nothing too significant. We do have a bit of a ding just up in the top of the bonnet, as you might be able to see uh, just there at the top, but not too significant at all. Moving down to the front end of the vehicle, we'll see those lovely clear front headlights. Got no scratches or cracking in the lenses there at all. And we'll just move across that front bumper and front grille really quickly. You can see that looking really, really nice and tidy on the front there. No significant damage, no damage to the grille at all. No missing pieces. Other headlights looking tidy. And just moving around to that front passenger corner. All looking good up there. And just down uh, on these wheel arches just here. Looking tidy there. And moving down to those front alloys. Got the same situation, got no curbs or scratches around the edges at all. You've got plenty of tread left on those tires. Moving down the passenger side of the vehicle. That passenger side, side mirror looking tidy, a few scuffs here and there, but nothing too significant. And just moving down those passenger side doors. As you can see, no significant car park dings or scratches at all, looking nice and tidy along there. And we'll just take you to the inside of the vehicle. As you can see, a bit of a wear just along the guard there, but the rest of the door card looking good. No serious damage around the switches or handles. Got a bit of creasing just on the side of the passenger seat there. Half leather, half fabric, as you can see. No significant tearing around the edges or even the seat base. And we'll just take you around to those rear seats now. <coughs> you see a bit of creasing just along there. But again, no significant tearing or damage to that seat at all. And the interior door card does have some wear on it just there, as you can see. Moving around to the rear panel. You can see just there, do have a bit of a ding. Just in the start of that wheel arch with a bit of a mark as well. And also just in the top of that wheel arch paint missing just there not too significant and that rear alloy just at the bottom there looking nice and tidy again with plenty of tread left on those tires <clears throat> moving around to that rear panel looking tidy across there rear arches or oh, sorry the rear tail lights looking tidy rear bumper got your reverse parking sensors as you can see all looking nice and tidy. Got a few marks just there, but not too significant. And you can see in that tailgate, no dings or significant scratches at all. You do have the mountain top rolling shutter just on the top of the vehicle here. Uh, it's not a rolling shutter actually, it is a hatch as you can see, just up like that. And see heavy load liner on the back here looking tidy some signs of use but no significant damage no big cracks tears or anything like that just close that all up and move around to that driver's side see looking nice and tidy in that rear tail light top of that rear panel looking good yeah, moving around to that rear arch. Looking good there as well. And that rear alloy looking nice and tidy. Again, no curbing or scratching and plenty of tread left on those tyres. Rear panel there looking good. And we'll just go down the driver's side doors now. As you can see, no significant car park dings in those doors at all. We do have some marks just in the back door, as you can see, 
just here and just above both of those doors in that top pillar you can see a bit of scuff uh, and a bit of missing paint as well just up across there take you to the inside of that rear driver's side door as you can see a bit of wear but no big significant damage some creasing on the seats no tearing around the outside or in the seat base at all just take you around to that front arch just there looking tidy and that front alloy once again no significant curving or scratching looking really nice and tidy with that side mirror just there again looking good moving to the inside of that driver's door very few signs of wear on there looking nice and tidy again no significant damage around these switches or handles a bit of creasing just on the driver's seat there but no tearing around the edge Got your electric seat controls just down here which includes your lumbar support got your back tilt you've also got your forwards backwards and your seat height and leg height just there trims all firmly in place not been damaged at all as you can see looking good there we'll get inside the vehicle now start the engine i'll show you a few features as you can see keyless entry and start stop We are just over 75,000 miles on the clock. This vehicle does have a full service history with it, so that's always really nice to have. Got your front heated seats just down here. Got your automatic gearbox. And you can see you've got your drivetrain controls just down there with your AC and your infotainment system just here. Cruise control and speed limiter just on the steering wheel there. And if I put this in reverse, you'll see we do have the uh, Navara 360 view camera and also the reversing camera just there. Got your main menu just here, which includes uh, some vehicle information. Got all your audio inputs just here, which includes your AM, FM, DAB radio, as well as your Bluetooth audio connectivity for your phone or mobile device. Got your satellite navigation and map just here you've also got your wireless um, and USB connections just across here this vehicle is available for viewing either through our online process or at our Hampshire based branch if you have any further questions or inquiries on this vehicle please do feel free to get in touch and thank you very much for watching